Hey, you remember a couple of weeks ago, it was probably last month, when um, this guy was going to go march to Moscow and demand XYZ from Putin. And yeah, I had posted a video. I said, Putin is going to kill the fuck out of this guy. Guess who did? Guess who did? Take a wild guess on who's dead. He did. Dead, dead, dead. Been dead now. Plane crash dead. No, no pieces of him to even resuscitate. Dead. That made it into heaven in bits and pieces. Dead. Fried. Dead. Yep. He didn't even make it to Labor Day. That was, I, I, I am, I'm only shocked that it took so long. I mean, we are dealing with Vladimir Putin. Nobody survives an actual challenge to him. And this was the guy that Trump absolutely loved. This guy, you know, he just thought he was the greatest, you know. Oh my God. This, I'm telling you, this is a crazy <laughs> world we live in. Y'all better, they, they, they're talking all this shit about woke. Y'all, you better, your ass better stay woke. You, you bet not, you better not fall asleep. Not right now. Not right now. Not with these events that are in, the, how fast this stuff is unfolding. The only challenge to Putin ever in his whole 40 year reign was this guy here. And he's dead. So any hope of, any type of reform on that side of the world is over with. And we all knew it was going to happen. I'm not even getting on here saying I told you so, but yeah, I saw the post of the video saying he wasn't going to live. He did, y'all. Gone. Bye-bye. Sunset.